All right, traders, we are at Fanex, and I'm going to run down a couple of the comic book stores that we have that are showing up here. There's been some cool books. Everybody's still setting up, so not everything is fully up and running. The doors open, I believe, at 2 o'clock, and you can come in and shop. So we're going to start with our hometown, hometown folks. Dr. Volt's Nerd Store. We've got the two booths right back to back. I think over here on the Nerd Store side, they got Funko Pops, a bunch of cool stuff, some bags, of course the belts, wearing one right now, posters, all kinds of cool stuff. They've got a couple con exclusives that they've done with some of the artists here, um, and we will show some of that later on in the day. But on the Dr. Bolt side, brought tons of books for you to, to dig through. And like I said the other day, I was with, I was having a conversation with Roger the other day, and he was going through books to put in these boxes. And I was amazed at the great stuff that they have in there. They've got, of course, 90s, some really sweet 90s image stuff in there i saw some really cool batman stuff some modern some exclusives some ratio variants like it, it's just crazy the amount of stuff that they have so come on in the nerd store is located between the 2000 and the 2100 signs right down the main aisle so make sure you pop in say hi they've got pokemon they've got magic and tons and tons of books and of course we're gonna pop over here we got and of course we got Kenny over here getting it all put together and he will be are you gonna be here all day uh, I'll be here for a while okay Kenny will be yep. here for a while come Definitely and say hi to Kenny day, but I'll be here for a, a lot of cool stuff all right, so this is our first booth that we're going to be showing you guys. A lot of great stuff already. That uh, World Tree signed by Tinian. Very cool. World Tree number one up there. Some cool Spider Man stuff. Real nice virgin covers for Elvira. Long Halloween, I see. Predator 1 in 25 ratio. Got a lot of great books in here. Check this out Gwyneth, Death of Gwen Stacy, the uh, facsimile. But they are in the process of getting this set up. They came all the way from Los Angeles to join us here at FanX. Make sure you stop in and say hi. A couple of nice guys selling books. Fancy paper. We like that. Some really cool stuff up there. Oh, sweet. Second printing. That one's actually a lot more rare than people give it credit for. <laughs> Should be worth a lot more than it is, in my opinion. But you guys know how I feel about that. So come and check them out. What booth number are you guys? Uh, we are, you know, little, little here. They're in the 2300 20, aisle. 2300 Kryptonian collectibles. Kryptonian collectibles. Right on. And right next to them, comic wise, these guys are from Bakersfield. They are going to be, I'm, I'm not sure what they're doing. I haven't had a chance to talk with these folks. But very cool. I see some OMAC in there. Love that old Kirby stuff. So there are comic books at FanX, guys. Come on down. Spend a few bucks. Enjoy the con. All right. Some of the comic creators are going to be here. Of course, we got John Gang. That's a good one. Um, Bob Camp's going to be here. We've got Amy Chu. I believe this is a return for Amy Chu. Of course, we come around here. We got Mark Bagley's going to be here doing signings. We've got Ryan Caddy. And of course, Mr. Clayton Crane is going to be here doing signings as well. So, a lot of great comic creators going to be here. And Mr. Adrian Rowe is going to be here. Local favorite. Everybody loves Adrian. So, I'm going to show that real quick so you can see what his prices are. So a lot of cool stuff. Jim Megan. Like 
if you are one of those Saturday morning cartoon types, this is definitely where you're going to want to be. And then we'll pop over here. Look what we got here. We've got Roger from the Nerd Store. And he's talking to David Barron, who I had the opportunity to meet today. A fantastic comic creator, really nice guy. Stop in and see him. What's up, guys? How you doing? So you've got an exclusive poster. Yeah, 11 right? by 17 print. 11 by 17 print that, that David did. Mm -hmm. And it's going to be here at Fanex. Yep. Going to be able to pick it up both at the Nerd Store booth mm -hmm. and here? Yep. Okay. So if you go over to the Nerd Store and you grab it there, um, buy a couple comics while you're there. Like I'm saying, Roger was insane throwing just killer books into the boxes. So make sure you get some of those. And then come over here, chat with David for a while. Great guy. We're really glad that you came into Utah. We appreciate you being here. Thank you. All right. Come in and see him, guys. Cheers. All right. So we're just going to do a quick walkthrough, show off some of the goodies that you can grab. I was buying this booth yesterday, and they've got sublimated metal prints. Oh, the 3Ds are killer. Their stuff is amazing. Amazing. So it's not just comic books, of course. Uh, they, they actually only have two or three comic dealers. they got great deals, which is uncommon for a comic convention to have such great deals. But they are there. Um, we got plenty of art, artists, and vendors, all your cosplay accessories. Everything's bustling and happening right now. Everybody's getting set up, ready to go in the next couple of hours. And then this place will be packed. If you've never been to Fanex before, we can give you kind of a, an overview of the size of this thing. I, it's just massive. Some of these booths, I've seen comic shops that are smaller than some of these booths. But you can pretty much find anything you want. They have all these cool foam swords and armor and stuff like that for the cosplayers. Um, Star Wars, of course, really huge. Just tons and tons of stuff to suck your wallet. <laughs> and I've seen, they, they have a booth here that sells nothing but lightsabers. Like every light, you can customize your own saber. That's very cool. Here's some of the cosplay weaponry. Like, uh, real weapons, very cool stuff. Zelda sword, armor. Dice for all of our dice goblin out there. A bunch of very cool sets. D20s, D100s. Dice have definitely come a long way since when I was younger. Our buddies over at Pop City, Utah are set up here. And they do a really good job getting a lot of the rare, hard-to-find stuff. Uh, these collections are incredible. So, and I'm going to quickly make it down this way. Because I want to kind of get a view backwards of all of this. So, it goes from that wall all the way to that wall. And all the way back down that far wall is down by where the nerd store is where I just was so just a huge area just packed and this is one room we've got multiple rooms you've got guest speaker panels you've got competitions and food trucks everything you can imagine a little Doctor Who experience Ghostbusters the pirates are here the D and D Tavern, so just all kinds of really cool stuff for you. So come on down to Fanex, check it out, pick up some comic books, and we'll see you later, traders.